गाइज वेलकम टू अवर चैनल आधार ऑपरेटर एंड सुपरवाइजर एकदम क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर टुडे वी आर स्टार्टिंग विथ इन न्यू चैप्टर चैप्टर वन इंट्रोडक्शन टू यू आई डी आई फॉर आइडियल इट्स एट वीडियो स्पीड एट वन पॉइंट टू फाइव एक्स देन वाच इट ओके लेट स्टार्ट चैप्टर वन इंट्रोडक्शन टू आंसर इज option b government of india then move on to question number 2 when was ui dai established as statutory authority under ministry of electronics and it option sir option a 28th january 2009 29th september 2010 12th september 2015 12th july 2016 and answer is option d 12th july 2016 then move on to question number 3 which organization is responsible for using uid option sir option a election commission option b planning commission option c maitri option d uida and answer is option d ui dai then move on to question number 4 why was ui dai created to provide reboost technology to eliminate duplicate and fake identities and option b to provide identity that can be verified and authenticated in an easy cost effective way option c to make another identification document option d both 1 and 2 and answer is option d both 1 and 2 then move on to question number 5 when was the aadhar enrollment update regulation 2016 published in official gazette ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए 28th जनवरी 2009 29th सितंबर 2010 12th जुलाई 2016 12th सितंबर 2017 एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी 12th सितंबर 2017 देन मूव ऑन टू क्वेश्चन नंबर 6 व्हाट डू यू मीन बाय आधार एनरोलमेंट और अपडेट प्रोसेस ऑप्शन सर option a the process to collect demographic and biometric information from individuals by the enrollment agencies for the purpose of issuing aadhar numbers to such individuals under the aadhar act option b process to collect personal information of the resident to issue identification number option c process to collect financial information like PAN number, bank account number to issue identification number. Option D, none of ever. And answer is option A. The process to collect demographic and biometric information from individuals by the enrollment agency for the for the purpose of issuing Aadhaar number to such individuals under the Aadhaar Act. Then move on to question number seven. What is the process of capturing? resident data both demographic and biometric for generation of aadhar card options are option a authentication option b enrollment option c identification option d presentation and answer is option b enrollment next this is any entity engaged by the registrar for the purpose of enrolling individuals 
ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए इंट्रोड्यूसर ऑप्शन बी एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी ऑप्शन सी सुपरवाइजर और ऑपरेटर ऑप्शन डी रजिस्टर्ड एंड आंसर इज एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी देन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द वेरीफायर और सर्टिफायर इज द पर्सनल अपॉइंटेड बाय डेस्क फॉर वेरिफिकेशन ऑफ डॉक्यूमेंट्स एट एनरोलमेंट सेंटर्स ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए ऑपरेटर ऑप्शन बी इंट्रोड्यूसर ऑप्शन सी रजिस्टर ऑप्शन डी एनरोलिंग एजेंसी एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी रजिस्टर देन नेक्स्ट डेस्क इज द प्लेस वेयर द आधार एनरोलमेंट और अपडेट इज कंडक्टेड बाय सर्टिफाइड ऑपरेटर और सुपरवाइजर ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए एनरोलमेंट सेंटर ऑप्शन बी एग्जाम सेंटर ऑप्शन सी हॉस्पिटल ऑप्शन डी स्कूल एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए एनरोलमेंट सेंटर नेक्स्ट डेस इज ए सर्टिफाइड पर्सनल एम्प्लॉयड बाय एनरोलमेंट एजेंसीज टू एग्जीक्यूट द प्रोसेस ऑफ एनरोलमेंट और अपडेट एट द एनरोलमेंट सेंटर ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए एनरोलमेंट ऑपरेटर ऑप्शन बी एनरोलमेंट सुपरवाइजर ऑप्शन सी इंट्रोड्यूसर ऑप्शन डी बोथ वन एंड टू एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी एनरोलमेंट सुपरवाइजर देन नेक्स्ट हु एमंग द फॉलोइंग एनश्योरेज एनश्योरेज द ओनली ट्रेंड एंड सर्टिफाइड पर्सनल हैंडल द एनरोलमेंट और अपडेट प्रोसेस ऑप्शन ए यू आई डी आई ऑप्शन बी ऑपरेटर ऑप्शन सी सुपरवाइजर ऑप्शन डी एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी देन नेक्स्ट डेस इज रेस्पॉन्सिबल टू कॉन्टेक्ट द सर्टिफिकेशन एग्जाम फॉर द रोल ऑफ ऑपरेटर और सुपरवाइजर इंट्रोड्यूसर एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी टेस्टिंग एंड सर्टिफिकेशन एजेंसी रजिस्टर एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी टेस्टिंग एंड सर्टिफिकेशन एजेंसी देन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन डेस इज ए पर्सन पर्सन रजिस्टर्ड विद द रजिस्टर एंड ऑथोरिटी हु कन्फर्म द आइडेंटिटी ऑफ ए पर्सन हु डज नॉट हैव एनी वैलिड पीओ आई एंड पीओ ए ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए ऑपरेटर ऑप्शन बी इंट्रोड्यूसर ऑप्शन सी एनरोलिंग एजेंसी ऑप्शन डी एजेंसी एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी इंट्रोड्यूसर नेक्स्ट डेस इज ए पर्सन रजिस्टर्ड विद द रजिस्टर एंड ऑथोरिटी हु कन्फर्म द आइडेंटिटी ऑफ ए पर्सन हु डज नॉट हैव ए वैलिड पीओ आई एंड पीओ ए Same, but option B. Introducer. Resident is an individual who among the resident in India for a period or periods amounting in all to days, days or more in the twelve months immediately preceding the date of application for other enrollment or update. Option sir. Option A thirty two. Option B sixty one. ऑप्शन सी 123, ऑप्शन डी 182. देन आंसर इज 182. देन नेक्स्ट हुई ऑफ द फॉलोइंग कॉन्टैक्ट नंबर कैन ए रेसिडेंट कॉल फॉर रिजोल्यूशंस टू दे आर कॉन्सर्न और ग्रीवियंस रिलेटेड टू आधार ऑप्शन ए 1947, ऑप्शन बी 2009, ऑप्शन डी 140, ऑप्शन डी 108. And answer is 1947. Then next, Aadhaar is unique because this. No two resident will have the same Aadhaar number. Option B, a family can get a unique recognized ID. A person can avail two Aadhaar numbers. Option D, none of the above. And answer is option A. No two residents will have the same Aadhar number. Please keep subscribe our channel, like and share with your friends. Next.
which of the following is not a component of enrollment setup options are option a computer option b biometric device option c bomb detector option d iris scanner and answer is option c bomb detector next which of the given is true about aadhar an individual can obtain multiple aadhar numbers aadhar collects financial information of residents aadhar can be used as proof of citizenship aadhar enables residents identification subject to successful authentication and answer is option d aadhar enables residents identification subject to successful authentication the next aadhar uses which of the given to uniquely identify the resident option a name and address of the resident option b fingerprints option c iris option d both 2 and 3 and answer is option d both 2 and 3 the next which of the given is true about the aadhar options are option a it is just another card option b will collected and recorded demographic and biometric information for generation of aadhar number option c aadhar will replace all the ids option d will collect profiling information such as caste religion language and answer is option b will collect and record demographic and biometric information for generation of aadhar number next dash is a document to convey the aadhar number to a resident options are option a aadhar letter option b cidr option c uid option d aadhar number and answer is aadhar letter next aadhar will be used to prove citizenship true or false and answer is false next aadhar will cover all residents of india who are residing in india for 180 days from the date of aadhar enrollment or update true or false and answer is true the next the vision of uidi is to empower residents of india with a unique identity and a digital platform to authenticate anytime anywhere options are option a true option b false and answer is option a true the next aadhar is a 15 digit number true or false and answer is false okay guys that's all for that chapter Thank you I hope you are enjoying the video keep subscribe our channel like and share if you are watching at facebook then like our page thank you guys hey guys welcome to our channel aadhar operator and supervisor exam question and answer chapter 2 registrar enrolling agency and enrollment staff For ideal read, set video speed at 1.25x, then watch it. Okay, let's start it. New syllabus, chapter two. Chapter two, registrar, enrolling agencies, and enrollment staff. Questions, first question: Which person or entity among the following is eligible to become a registrar? options are option a any individual option b any entity under central government ministry state government option c any citizen of india option d any individual capable of running a business and answer is option b any entity under central government ministry state government question number 2 which of the following should be avoided not to be done by the registrar options are option a responsible for field level execution monitoring and audit 
ऑप्शन बी डिस्प्ले एडिक्यूट इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट आधार एनरोलमेंट एंड अपडेट ऑन देयर वेबसाइट ऑप्शन सी यूज द इंफॉर्मेशन कलेक्टेड ड्यूरिंग एनरोलमेंट फॉर एनी पर्पज अदर देन आधार एनरोलमेंट और अपडेट ऑप्शन डी अलाउ यू आई डी आई रिजनेबल एक्सेस टू द प्रेमिसेस ऑक्युपाइड बाय इट इन केस रिक्वायर्ड एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी यू द इंफॉर्मेशन कलेक्टेड ड्यूरिंग एनरोलमेंट फॉर एनी पर्पज अदर देन आधार एनरोलमेंट और अपडेट क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री रजिस्टर सेल एट ऑल टाइम एबाइड बाय द कोड ऑफ कंडक्ट एज स्पेसिफाइड इन टेस्ट फॉर आधार एनरोलमेंट और ऑप्शन सारे ऑप्शन ए आधार एक्ट 2016 आधार रेगुलेशन ऑप्शन बी जी एफ आर रूल्स ऑप्शन सी बोथ वन एंड टू ऑप्शन डी नॉन ऑफ द एब एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए आधार एक्ट टू एंड आधार रेगुलेशन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन हु एमंग द फॉलोइंग इज रेस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर इवेल्युएटिंग द एप्लीकेशन ऑफ एजेंसीज एंड एम्पेनाल द इलिजिबल एजेंसी एज एनरोलिंग एजेंसीज ई एनरोलिंग एजेंसी ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए सेंट्रल मिनिस्ट्री ऑप्शन बी रेजिस्टर एंड यू आई डी आई ऑप्शन सी बोथ वन एंड टू ऑप्शन डी यू आई डी आई एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी रेजिस्टर एंड यू आई डी आई देन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन व्हाट आर द बेसिक रेस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी ऑफ रेजिस्टर ऑप्शन आर ऑप्शन ए एडरेंस टू आधार एक्ट 2016 एंड आधार रेगुलेशन ऑप्शन बी हायर और एनगेज एनरोल एनरोलिंग एजेंसी एंड मॉनिटर इट्स फंक्शन ऑप्शन सी एनश्योर दैट एनी एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी एंड और पर्सन एम्प्लॉयड और अपॉइंटेड बाय देम टू कंडक्ट द एनरोलमेंट एंड अप टू डेट ऑपरेशन आर सर्टिफाइड ऑप्शन डी ऑल ऑफ द एब एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी ऑल ऑफ द एब ओके नेक्स्ट व्हिच पर्सन और एंटिटी एमंग द फॉलोइंग इज एलिजिबल टू बिकम ए एनरोलिंग एजेंसी ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए एनी इंडिविजुअल fulfilling the condition mentioned in RFE for enrollment agency specified by registrar or UIDI option B any individual capable of running a business option C any certified operator or supervisor option D any individual who own a other enrollment or update team and answer is any individual fulfilling the condition mentioned in RFE for enrollment agency specified by registrar or UIDI then next which of the following criteria should an individual qualify to be eligible for a supervisor role b1 should be age 18 year and above shall be 10th plus 2 pass should have aadhar number should have obtained supervisor certificate from a testing and certification agency should have obtained a certificate in basics of computer options are option 1 2 and 3 option b 1 3 and 4 option c 1 2 3 4 option d all the given option and answer is option c 1 2 3 and 4 should be as above 18 shall be 10 plus 2 pass should have aadhar number should have open supervisor certificate from a testing and certification agency then next which of the following should an individual process before starting his or her role as a enrollment agency supervisor options are option a should possess basic in computer education certificate should be a graduate should be comfortable with local language keyboard and translate translation option d should be a 
prominent person within the given region and answer is option C should be comfortable with local language keyboard and translation next who among the following is responsible for setting up of the laptop or desktop with other client installed and tested at enrollment center option a authority option b registrar option c operator or supervisor option d it technician and answer is option c operator or supervisor next supervisor must submit his or her own boarding format along with the required documents to the enrollment agency which in turn submits the form test concern for verification options are option a authority as regional offices option b verification officer option c another supervisor option d registrar office and answer is authority as regional offices next who among the following is considered as enrolled user during the operator supervisor onboarding option a a user who introduce other resident who cannot produce produce poi or poa a user who has fill the enrollment form to get aadhar option c a user who has appeared at an enrollment center to get enrolled for aadhar option d operator or supervisor whose biometric verification is successfully completed and stored in the enrollment line and answer is option d operator or supervisor whose biometric verification is successfully completed and stored in the enrollment client next in case of introducer based enrollment which of the given additional information shall be collected introducer signature introducer home impression introducer aadhar number required options are option a only one option b only two option c both one and two option d all the given option and answer is option d all the given option the next as part of managing the enrollment center which of the following should a supervisor do options are option a signing of every enrollment on aadhar client option b use find aadhar facility to ensure fresh residents have never enrolled option c ensure that the operation operator provides his or her biometric confirmation after every aadhar enrollment or update option d all of the above and answer is all of the above the next supervisor also ensures that enrollment stations are synchronized at least once in every day 10 days 15 days 20 days month and answer is every 10 days next which of the following should a supervisor ensure to backup synchronize or export data take backup of all the enrollment data twice a day to external hard disk send all the day to day enrollment details to your personal email id synchronize enrollment station at least once in every 10 days maintain a register for data export save all data on google cloud options are option 1 2 for of option b 1 3 for option c 2 3 4 5 option d all the given options and answer is option b 1 3 4 next at the end of the day supervisor should allow the operator to review the enrollment packets created by him options are option a true or option b false and answer is option b false the next in case of any error found in the enrollment data entered which of the following should be done option a use discretion to fill in the details correctly a supervisor needs to identify the correct data 
ऑप्शन सी इन्फॉर्मेश इन्फॉर्म द रेसिडेंट टू कॉम टू द एनरोलमेंट सेंटर विद इन करेक्शन टाइम फ्रेम ऑप्शन डी गो टू द रेसिडेंट्स हाउस एंड कलेक्ट द ट्राई डिटेल्स एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी इन्फॉर्म द रेसिडेंट टू कॉम टू द एनरोलमेंट सेंटर विद इन करेक्शन टाइम फ्रेम नेक्स्ट हुई ऑफ द फॉलोइंग एक्शन शुड ए सुपरभाइजर डू आफ्टर डे एंड रिव्यू ऑप्शन ए साइन अप बाय गिविंग हिज और हार फिंगरप्रिंट सेंड ए मेल टू अथॉरिटी सेंड बल्क एस एम एस एस टू द रेसिडेंट्स एनरोल्ड फॉर द डे आस्क ऑपरेटर टू साइन अप बाय गिविंग हिज और हार फिंगरप्रिंट एंड आंसर इज साइन अप बाय गिविंग हिज और हार फिंगरप्रिंट एंड नेक्स्ट ए सुपरभाइजर मॉनिटर एंड ऑडिट द फंक्शन एट द एनरोलमेंट सेंटर हाउ ड द ऑडिट फीडबैक हेल्प द एंटायर टीम ऑप्शन ए रिमूव द अंडर परफॉर्मिंग ऑपरेटर्स कॉल्ड द पे ऑफ द ऑपरेटर्स हुई परफॉर्मेंस इज नॉट अप टू द बेंचमार्क आइडेंटिफाई द एरियाज ऑफ इम्प्रूवमेंट ऑफ एनरोलमेंट ऑपरेशन एंड डाटा क्वालिटी एस्केलेट द मैटर्स to the authority and answer is option c identify the area of improvement of enrollment operation and data quality next who is an operator or supervisor a person who handle the function of an enrollment agency like clearing electricity connection etc a mediator between the authority and enrollment agency an individual employed by an enrollment agency to execute enrollment at the enrollment stations option d a resident who come to enroll enrollment agency to get enrolled for other and answer is option c an individual employed by an enrollment agency to execute enrollment at the enrollment stations Next, which of the following is the eligibility criteria for an individual to work for the role of operator or supervisor? Person should have between 18 and 20 years of age. Option B, person should be a graduate. Option C, person should be expert in Java. Option D, person should have obtained operator or supervisor certificate from an from a testing and certification agency and answer is option d person should have obtained operator or supervisor certificate from a testing and certification agency next which of the following should an operator or supervisor must ensure when checking residents other enrollment or update form option a has resident thumbprint has operator's thumbprint has verifier signature has the introducers or hof's signature and answer is option c has verifier's signature next operator should make sure that the resident's screen is off when capturing his or her biometric and iris option a yes option b no and answer is option b no Next operator should ask the resident to cross check the data being entered and review demographic data with resident before signing up. Option A true or false. Option is option A true. The next in case of anganwadi asha worker who want wants to be a CLC operator what should be his or her minimum qualification? 10th pass, 12th pass, graduate diploma holder and answer is option a 10th pass who among the following has the authority to approve or reject the onboarding of operators option a any other operator option b uidi regional office option c supervisor option d resident and answer is option b uidi regional office then move on to next which of the following is used to enroll a child option a c e l c tablet any 
desktop computer with CELC client installed, any laptop with CELC client installed, enrollment form. And answer is option A CELC tablet. Next question number 28 Which of the following is done to add a CELC operator in the other client software? Options are option A Take the operator's original identity proof documents. Option B Take the operator's signature. Take the operator's biometrics. Take the operator's original qualification certificate. And answer is Take the operator's biometrics. Then who is a verifier? Who one who verifies if the give biometrics are right? Option B One who verifies the documents and enrollment or update form submitted by the resident. Option C One who verifies that the resident is enrolling for the first time. Option D One who ensures that the resident is at at least a graduate before enrolled and answer is b one who verify the documents and enrollment or update form submitted by the resident then question number 30 who among the following are well suited for the role of verifier a private school teacher retired government officials well educated housewife military personnel and answer is retired government official the next question which of the following documents submitted by a resident is acceptable for verification purpose as POA answers are option A original educational qualification documents option B photocopy of PAN card attested by a gazetted officer option C electricity electricity bill not older than three months d all the given option and answer is option c electricity bill not older than three months then question number 32 in which of the following instance can a verifier refuse verification options are option a if he finds that the detail in a document are edited option b if the photocopy of education qualification certificate is submitted option c if the resident submits electricity bill as proof of address option d both one and two and answer is option d both one and two then question number 33 poi re requires a document containing the resident's name and mobile number residential address email address photograph and answer is photograph then question number 34 a resident approached you for other enrollment the resident's name in the POI is Chandra Prasad whereas in the POA it is Chandra Sekhar what would you do in such a case options are option A enter the name as Chandra Prasad enter the name as Chandra Sekhar enter the name as Chandra Sekhar Prasad reject the application and answer is reject the application question number 35 what would you do in case the two documentary proofs produced by the employee have variation in the same name enter the name as given in educational qualification enter the resident's full name enter the name as suggested by the resident enter the name as recorded in POA document and answer is option D enter the name as recorded in POA document then question number 36 which of the following should operator do before taking his role as operator option A complete his studied and not engage in any other education related activities during his tenure read and complete training material on other enrollment or update available available on authority website and get verified get get trained on software technology sorry 
like C and Java. Option D, all the given options. And answer is option B, read the complete training material on other enrollment or update available on authority website and get verified. Question number 37, supervisor must ensure that staff at the center don't ask for any additional money except for the prescribed fee. Options A true, option B false and answer is option A true. Option question number 38, any serving or retired official both from government and PSUs include banks not below the rank of desk may be allowed to be deployed as verifier. Option A group A, option B group B, option C group C, option D manager and answer is option C group C. Then question number 39, which of the following items of information is only collected for records and no verification will be carried out? Option A, information on parents in case of adults, information on education qualification, information related to address in case of child, information related to parents in case of child. And answer is option A, information on parents in case of adults. Which of the following should be done to establish the relationship between of and and the family members. Option A verify the POR document, interview the family members, ask for DNA report, verify with the neighbors of the family. And answer is option A verify the POR document. Next 41 head of family must always accompany the family member when the family member is getting enrolled. Option A true, option B false and answer is option A true. Keep subscribe our channel, like and share with your friends. Okay, next move on to question number 42. It is not mandatory to verify the HOF details in the enrollment or update form in case of obvious verification. Option A true, option B false and answer is option B false. Question number 43. It is not essential to mention the relationship details in case of HOF based enrollments. Option A true, option B false and answer is option B false. Question number 44. In case of introducer based enrollment only introducer's name as additional information is required. Option A true, option B false and answer is option B false. Question number 45. It is mandatory to note the religion and caste when enrolling a resident for Aadhaar. Options A true, option B false and answer is option B false. Then question number 46. In case of head of family based enrollment the HOF's Aadhaar number should be verified against his or her Aadhaar letter. Option A true, option B false and answer is option A true. Question number 47. Residential address is an additional demographic information required for enrollment. Option A true, option B false. Answer is option B false. Then question number 48. Who among the following can be an introducer? A. Registrar employee, head of the family, any Indian citizen, a farmer. Answer is Registrar employee. Then, question number 49. Name is a demographic information required to be provided during enrollment. Option A true, option B false. And answer is option A true. Question number 50. Gender is a demographic information required to be provided during enrollment. Option A true, option B false. And answer is option A true. Question number 51. The operator should take the resident's mobile number mandatorily and enter the same in enrollment form. 
option a true option b false and answer is option b false an operator should capture gps coordinates at the start of enrollment every day option a true option b false and answer is option a true question number 53 which of the following demographic information shall be collected from all individuals undergoing enrollment other than children below 5 years of age answers are option a name mobile number height eye color option b name gender birth certificate mother's birth certificate option c name date of birth gender residential address option d name place height mobile number and answer is name date of birth gender residential address then question number 54 a resident baktiar rahul sharma has approached you for enrollment which of the following is the right way for entering his name in the system option a b r sharma option b b rahul sharma option c baktiar rahul sharma option d b r s and answer is option c baktiar rahul sharma question number 55 sukumar rajpal has approached you to get enrolled for aadhar you find that his graduation certificate which is submitted as poi has sukumar rajpal and whereas electricity bill which is submitted as poa has uh, raj sukumar pal in this case what should be the name entered in aadhar enrollment form options are option a rs pal option b raj sukumar pal option c sukumar rajpal option d as declared by the resident and answer is option d as declared by the resident question number 56 which of the following should an operator ensure before starting his or her day? first ensure the date and time on the system is current date and time b2 capture gps coordinates b3 send sms to all residents in the region to come and enroll option ib ensure that the station layout is as per authority guideline and answer is options are option a 1 2 3 option b 1 3 option c 3 4 option d 1 2 4 and answer is option d 1 2 4 then question number 57 the authority may authorize register to charge dash from the residents not exceeding an amount specified by the authority for update of demographic information and biometric information option a convenience fee register fee observer fee introducer fee and answer is option a convenience fee question number 58 which of the following software can be used for updating mobile number or email id update client light ecm mp clp none of the given and answer is option a update client light question number 59 the authority shall require the biometric information of children to be updated upon attending days of age and days of age in accordance with the procedure specified by the authority which is a mandatory update for children 2 year 12 year 5 year 15 year 10 year 18 years 4 year 16 year and answer is 5 year and 15 years question number 60 which of the following should operator ensure duly during enrollment or update process options are option a enrollment or update form is uploaded option b supporting documents and signed slips are uploaded option c all documents are returned to the resident after enrollment 
option D all the given option and answer is option D all the given option question number 61 what is the key responsibility of a CELC operator to check enrollment and update form only to be enrolled or update only and answer is to enroll or update only question number 62 which of the following software can be used for updating demographic biometric detail update client light ec mp celp api and answer is option b ec mp question number 63 which of the following certificates a celc operator should have obtained Diploma in Software Technology Certificate in Basic of Computer CELC Operator Certificate Enrollment Operator Certificate And answer is CELC Operator Certificate Question number 64 Which of the following statement is true about introducers? Option 1 Introducers will be linked to a registrar Option 2 Introducers must have must not have a criminal record. Option 3 Introducer should be the head of the family. Option 4 Introducer must be above 18 years. Option 5 Introducer can only introduce people within the registrar jurisdiction. And options are option A 135. Option B 1245 Option C 24 Option D 245 And answer is Option B 1, 2, 4 and 5 Then question number 65 The verifier should ensure that The name in the POA document matches with the name in the POI document True or false And answer is Option A True Question number 66 Whose name should be given in care of field? Child's name, any person who is 18 year old and above mother's name, head of the family. And answer is head of the family. Question number 67 Which of the following is mandatory when enrolling a child? Options are Option A Parents Aadhaar Number, Option B Parents Educational Qualification Certificate Option C A Signature of a Gadgeted Officer on Child's Birth Certificate Option D Introduction Form and Introduction And answer is Option A Parents Aadhaar Number Question number 68 Which of the following is an unacceptable act from the introduction? Option A Helping a resident enroll for Aadhaar Introducing the resident to the other operator Confirm the identity and address of the resident Helping resident to impersonate his father And answer is option D Helping resident to impersonate his father Question number 69 Introducers have to provide their biometric on other client to Enders a resident enrollment true or false and answer is option a true question number 70 other service providers may be appointed or engaged by the authority from time to time for discharging any function related to the desk enrollment process or updating of information options are option a biometric option b audit option c identity proof option d resident and answer is option d resident question number 71 the authority shall provide desk using which the registrar can onboard an empaneled enrolling agency to the cidr options are option a database of resident detail Option B Enrollment ID Option C Open Request for Enrollment Option D Enrolling Agency Board And answer is 
ऑप्शन डी एनरोलिंग एजेंसी कोड क्वेश्चन नंबर 72 एनरोलिंग एजेंसी सेल एट ऑल टाइम एबाइड बाय द डेस फॉर सर्विस प्रोवाइडर्स एज स्पेसिफाइड इन शेड्यूल बी ऑफ दिस रेगुलेशन ऑप्शन ए एथिक्स ऑप्शन बी कोड ऑफ कंडक्ट ऑप्शन सी वैल्यूज ऑप्शन डी गाइडलाइन एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी कोड ऑफ कंडक्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर 73 इफ द आइडेंटिफाइड इंट्रोड्यूसर इज रेडी टू वर्क एज एन इंट्रोड्यूसर ही और शी विल हैव टू टेस्ट टू बीइंग एन इंट्रोड्यूसर फॉर द पर्पस ऑफ एनेबलिंग आधार एनरोलमेंट ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए सबमिट हिज ओरिजिनल पीओआई सर्टिफिकेट ऑप्शन बी साइन रेसिडेंट्स एनरोलमेंट फॉर्म ऑप्शन सी गिव ए रिटर्न कंसेंट ऑप्शन डी ऑल द गिवन ऑप्शन एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी गिव ए रिटर्न कंसेंट क्वेश्चन नंबर 74 रजिस्ट्रार शैल बी रेस्पोंसिबल फॉर फील्ड लेवल एजुकेशन मॉनिटरिंग एंड ऑडिटिंग ट्रू और फॉल्स ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए ट्रू ऑप्शन बी फॉल्स एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए ट्रू क्वेश्चन नंबर 75 रजिस्ट्रार शैल यूज द इंफॉर्मेशन कलेक्टेड ड्यूरिंग एनरोलमेंट फॉर एनी पर्पस अदर देन द अपलोडिंग इंफॉर्मेशन टू द सीआईडीआर ऑप्शन ट्रू और फॉल्स एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी फॉल्स 76 रजिस्ट्रार आर परमिटेड टू सब कॉन्ट्रैक्ट एनरोलमेंट फंक्शंस बाय एनरोलिंग एजेंसी टू थर्ड पार्टीज ट्रू और फॉल्स एंड आंसर इज फॉल्स 77 सर्विस प्रोवाइडर्स सेल मेक बेस्ट एफर्ट्स टू प्रोटेक्ट द इंटरेस्ट ऑफ डेस ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए रजिस्ट्रार ऑप्शन बी ऑब्जर्वर ऑप्शन सी रेसिडेंट्स ऑप्शन डी एजेंसी एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी रेसिडेंट्स देन क्वेश्चन नंबर 78 द अथॉरिटी सेल एम्पैनल द एनरोलिंग एजेंसीज थ्रो डेस ओपन RFE process observer registrar UIDI and answer is option A open RFE process question number 79 registrar may permit field level manpower to be hired through third party option A true option B false and answer is option A true then question number 80 the final number of this video after that we have we got to make the part 2 okay let's move question number 80 the authority shall provide an enrolling agency for using which the registrar can onboard an empaneled enrolling agency to the desk uidi aadhar cidr and directory dir and answer is c i d r okay last question of this video question number 81 the enrolling agency can use the information collected during enrollment for any purpose other than uploading information to the c i d r option sir option a the recapture button the print biometric accession button the force capture button the biometric exception capture button and answer is option d the biometric exception capture button okay guys next see you in part 2 chapter 2 part 2 see you in the next video okay that's all for today keep subscribe our channel like and share with your friends if you are watching at facebook then like our okay thank you guys hey guys welcome to our channel aadhar operator and supervisor exam question and answer chapter 3 onboarding enrollment agency and enrollment staff the new syllabus based course for ideal read set video speed at 1.25x then watch it okay let's start 
चैप्टर थ्री ऑनबोर्डिंग एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी एंड एनरोलमेंट स्टाफ क्वेश्चन नंबर वन द रजिस्टर एंड एनरोल एजेंसी सेल ओनली यूज द एनरोलमेंट और अपडेट सॉफ्टवेयर प्रोवाइडेड और ऑथोराइज बाय द डेस ऑप्शन ए ऑपरेटर ऑप्शन बी यू आई डी आई ऑप्शन सी सुपरवाइजर ऑप्शन डी रेसिडेंट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी यू आई डी आई देन मूव ऑन टू क्वेश्चन नंबर टू टेस्ट कोऑर्डिनेट्स द ऑनबोर्डिंग प्रोसेस ऑफ ऑपरेटर और सुपरवाइजर व्हिच रजिस्टरर एंड ईएस ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए ऑपरेटर ऑप्शन बी ऑब्जर्वर ऑप्शन सी ऑथोरिटी हेड ऑफ हेड ऑफिस और ऑथोरिटीज रीजनल ऑफिस डी एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी ऑथोरिटी हेड ऑफिस और ऑथोरिटीज रीजनल ऑफिस नेक्स्ट टेस्ट टू कैप्चर कोऑर्डिनेट ऑफ द एनरोलमेंट डिवाइस नीड्स टू अवेलेबल एट ऑल टाइम ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए टेलीविजन ऑप्शन बी जीपीएस डिवाइस ऑप्शन सी एफ एम रेडियो एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी जीपीएस डिवाइस देन नेक्स्ट डेस्क मॉनिटर द एप्रुवल ऑफ एनरोलमेंट सेंटर प्लान एंड ए इंटरवेंस वे आर रिकॉर्डेड ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए रजिस्टर ऑप्शन बी अथॉरिटी हेड ऑफिस और अथॉरिटीज रीजनल ऑफिस ऑप्शन सी ऑब्जर्वर ऑप्शन डी ऑपरेटर एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी अथॉरिटी हेड ऑफिस और अथॉरिटीज रीजनल ऑफिस नेक्स्ट टेस्ट डिक्लेयर्स एनरोलमेंट स्टेशन डिप्लोमेंट प्लान दैट इज व्हेन एंड वेयर द सेंटर्स विल बी एस्टैब्लिश बिफोर ओपनिंग एनी एनरोलमेंट सेंटर ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए रजिस्टर ऑप्शन बी अथॉरिटीज रीजनल ऑफिस ऑप्शन सी एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी ऑप्शन डी ऑब्जर्वर आंसर इज एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी एंड नेक्स्ट डेस्क नीड्स टू एनश्योर एंड प्रूव दैट दे हैव सर्टिफाइड द एक्टिव ऑपरेटर रिक्विजिशन मशीन्स एंड हार्डवेयर टू बी डिप्लॉयड एट एनरोलमेंट सेंटर ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए रजिस्टर ऑप्शन बी अथॉरिटीज रीजनल ऑफिस ऑप्शन सी इंट्रोड्यूसर ऑप्शन डी एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी देन नेक्स्ट डेस्क अपडेट एनरोलमेंट सेंट्रल सेंटर इंफॉर्मेशन ऑन द यू आई डी ए पोर्टल ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए एन एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी ऑप्शन बी ऑथोरिटीज रीजनल ऑफिस ऑप्शन सी इंट्रोड्यूसर ऑप्शन डी रजिस्टर एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए एनरोलमेंट एजेंसी नेक्स्ट डैश नीड्स टू बी कनेक्टेड टू द इंटरनेट ड्यूरिंग द प्रोसेस ऑफ ऑन बॉडी ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए एनरोलमेंट क्लाइंट ऑप्शन बी ऑपरेटर सुपरवाइजर इंट्रोड्यूसर ऑप्शन सी रजिस्टर ऑप्शन डी इंट्रोड्यूसर एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए एनरोलमेंट क्लाइंट नेक्स्ट एनरोलमेंट क्लाइंट नीड्स टू बी कनेक्टेड टू द डेस ड्यूरिंग द प्रोसेस ऑफ ऑन बोर्डिंग ऑन एनरोलमेंट स्टाफ ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए इथरनेट ऑप्शन बी रजिस्टर ऑप्शन सी इंटरनेट ऑप्शन डी ऑब्जर्व एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी इंटरनेट The next enrollment agencies will have to undergo an onboarding process for days. Option C or option A, authorities regional office. Option B, self enrollment station and enrollment staff. Option C, completion of enrollment. Option D, updating activities. And answer is option B, self enrollment station and stop the next for onboarding of operator supervisor the user credential file generate is a digitally signed by test file option sir option a dot mp3 option b dot docx option c dot xls option d dot XML and answer is 
xml then next if verification of user's biometric details is successfully completed with his or her other details and stored in local database he is a dash user option a onboarded option b enrolled option c both one and two option d not enrolled and answer is option c both one and two onboard and enrolled then question number 13 when the quality of biometrics is above threshold test will be shown to user confirming his or her approval options are option a pass indicator option b left slab option c right slab option d two thumbs and answer is pass indicator and next Question number 14. After biometrics of operator or supervisor are captured on enrollment client, authentication request is sent to test server. Options A. Registerer. Option B. Enrollment station. Option C. Authorities. Option D. Enrollment agency. And answer is Option C. Authority. And question number 15. Dash is not required while Onboarding disassociation of the operator or supervisor. Options are option A status of entity, option B pass indicator, option C status, option D biometrics confirmation. And answer is option D biometric confirmation. Question number 16 Only after successful verification of biometrics of operator or supervisor with CIDR, the user dash is allowed to proceed. Option A, enrollment button, option B, onboarding, option C, disassociation, option D, authentication and answer is onboarding. Question number 17, authority headquarter or authority's regional office coordinate with dash the onboarding process of enrollment staff options are option a enrollment session option b enrollment clients option c registrar and enrollment agencies option d observers and introducers and answer is registrars and enrollment agency then question number 18 during local biometric verification the biometrics provided by the days are verified form the biometrics stored in the enrollment client options are option a enrollment agency option b operator or supervisor option c registrar option d user and answer is operator or supervisor then question number 19 if the verification of user's biometric details is not successfully completed and not stored in the local database it will appear as test in status options are option a onboard option b enrolled option c not enrolled option d with help and answer is option c not enrolled then question number 20 Enrollment agency will update enrollment center information on the test quota. The latest URL needs to be confirmed by the test. Options are option A enrollment station, registrar, option B operator or supervisor, authorities regional office, option C QA MIS portal, nodal officer, option D MG. MNRE Monrega website enrollment agency and answer is QMIS portal or nodal officer. Question number 21 for days and days onboarding and local biometrics verification is mandatory for login 
on to the enrollment client options are option a introducer registrar option b operator supervisor option c enrollment agency enrollment client option d introducer registrar and answer is option b operator supervisor next during authentication biometrics of the operator or supervisor are compared against the biometric provided by them during the time of their own death option a association option b enrollment option c disassociation option d hiring and answer is option b enrollment Question number 23 The enrollment client check that the operator or supervisor are not deaf or deaf and restrict them from onboarding. Option A suspended, blacklisted, option B associated or onboard, option C none of the above, option D both 1 and 2. Answer is option D, both 1 and 2. Then question number 24. The operator or supervisor can be onboarded on multiple enrollment clients without the association. Option A, true. Option B, false. And answer is option B, false. Then question number 25. Blacklisted operator or supervisor can be allowed to work using different certificate option a true option b false option b false okay dear that's all for today thank you keep subscribe our channel if you are watching at facebook then like our page thank you guys best of luck hey guys welcome to our channel other operator and supervisor exam question and answer chapter 3 onboarding enrollment agency and enrollment staff for ideal read set video speed at 1.25x then watch check out the description for pdf link okay let's start chapter 4 other enrollment or update process option question number 1 what is the waiting time for other generation? Option A 1 to 2 weeks, Option B within 7 days, Option C up to 90 days, Option D 6 months. And answer is Option C up to 90 days. Next question What are the different type of other enrollment? Options are Option A document based enrollment, Option B document based, introducer based, head of family based, and child enrollment. C physical enrollment online enrollment and answer is document based introducer based head of family based and child enrollment next which form needs to be filled by the resident for other enrollment options are option a other enrollment or correction form option b matriculation form option c registration form option d application form and answer is other enrollment or correction form next Multiple other numbers are generated in case of multiple enrollments. Option are option A true, option B false, and answer is option B false. Next, other number will be generated in one day. True or false, and answer is false. And question number six acknowledgement slip provided to the resident after other enrollment contents. Yes. Option A EID, enrollment ID, option B other number, option C photo of enrollment operator, option D photo of proof of address and proof of identity. And answer is option A EID. The next there is only one type of other enrollment such as document based enrollment. Option A true, option B false and answer is option b false the next who among the following is eligible to avail other 
ऑप्शन ए एनी सिटीजन ऑफ इंडिया एनी इंडिविजुअल हु इज 18 इयर्स एंड अबव ऑप्शन सी एनी रेसिडेंट हु रिसाइड्स इन इंडिया फॉर अ पीरियड ऑफ 182 डेज और मोर ऑप्शन डी एनी सिटीजन ऑफ इंडिया हु इज अ ग्रेजुएट एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी एनी रेसिडेंट हु रिसाइड इन इंडिया फॉर अ पीरियड ऑफ 182 डेज और मोर The next any resident who resides in India for a period of 182 days or more who possess required documents is eligible for aadhar enrollment true or false and answer is option A true Then question number 10 any citizen of India even those who have been residing in a foreign country for the last 1 year are eligible for aadhar ऑप्शन आर ऑप्शन ए ट्रू ऑप्शन बी फॉल्स एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी फॉल्स देन क्वेश्चन नंबर 11 एनी रेसिडेंट हु डू नॉट हैव एनी डॉक्यूमेंट और इलिजिबल फॉर अदर टाइप ऑफ एनरोलमेंट कैन आल्सो बी एनरोल्ड ऑप्शन ए ट्रू ऑप्शन बी फॉल्स एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी फॉल्स नेक्स्ट इन केस ऑफ कमीशन ऑफ आधार नंबर फॉर Regions other than multiple Aadhaar numbers having having been issued, residents shall be required to re-enroll. In case of commission of Aadhaar number for regions other than multiple Aadhaar number having been issued, residents shall be required to re-enroll. Option A true, option B false, and answer is option A true. The next. Which of the following are mandatory in document based enrollment? Option R, option A, the resident submits his EOI, POA and POR. Option B, an elected local body introduces the resident to the operator. Option C, the father introduces his child. Option D, all of the above. And answer is option A. The resident submits his POI, POA, and POR. The next, which of the following items are information relating to introducer is captured in introducer based enrollment? B2 introducer's name, B2 introducer's Aadhaar number, B3 introducer's family details, B4 introducer's educational qualification. with five biometric information of introducer options are option a 1 2 3 option b 2 3 4 option c 1 2 5 option d all the given option and answer is option c 1 2 5 and next who can become introducer for facilitating introducer based enrollment ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए ऑपरेटर और सुपरवाइजर ऑप्शन बी ए रजिस्टर एम्प्लॉ इलेक्टेड लोकल बॉडी मेंबर मेंबर्स ऑफ लोकल एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव बॉडी ऑप्शन सी इन्फ्लुएंसर सच एज टीचर अंगनवाड़ी वर्कर रिप्रेजेंटेटिव ऑफ एनजीओ ऑप्शन डी बथ टू एंड थ्री एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी बथ टू एंड थ्री मीन्स रजिस्टर एम्प्लॉज इलेक्टेड लोकल बॉडी मेंबर मेंबर्स ऑफ लोकल एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव बॉडीज इन्फ्लुएंसर सच एज टीचर अंगनवाड़ी वर्कर रिप्रेजेंटेटिव ऑफ एनजीओ आर कैन बी कैम इंट्रोड्यूसर फॉर फैसिलिटिंग इंट्रोड्यूसर बेस्ड एनरोलमेंट नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्सटीन कैन ऑपरेटर और सुपरवाइजर कैन बी कैम इंट्रोड्यूसर ऑप्शन ए नो ऑप्शन बी यस एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए नो ऑपरेटर और सुपरवाइजर कैन नॉट बी इंट्रोड्यूसर क्वेश्चन नंबर 17 व्हिच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग रेफर्स टू इंट्रोड्यूसर बेस्ड एनरोलमेंट ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए द रेसिडेंट सबमिट्स हिज पीओआई पीओए एंड पीओआर डॉक्यूमेंट्स ऑप्शन बी ए हेल्थ वर्कर रेफर्स द रेसिडेंट टू द ऑपरेटर Option C the father introduces his child option D all the given option 
एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी ए हेल्थ वर्कर रेफर्स द रेसिडेंट टू द ऑपरेटर नेक्स्ट हो एमंग द फॉलोइंग इज एलिजिबल फॉर चाइल्ड एनरोलमेंट ऑप्शन ए एनी चाइल्ड हु इज एटलीस्ट फोर इयर ओल्ड एंड एब ऑप्शन बी एनी चाइल्ड हु इज एटेंडिंग स्कूल एनी चाइल्ड हु इज लेस देन फाइव इयर ऑफ एज एनी चाइल्ड हु इज बिटवीन फाइव एंड सिक्सटीन इयर ऑफ एज एंड एंसर इज ऑप्शन सी एनी चाइल्ड हु इज लेस देन फाइव इयर्स ऑफ एज क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइनटीन Any adult can be enrolled as a child without capturing the biometric information if the resident suggested. Option C, option A, true. Option B, false. And answer is option B, false. Next question number twenty. Biometric information is required for enrollment from all individuals, including children below five years of age. Option A, true. Option B, false. And answer is option B. नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इंफॉर्मेशन इज नॉट रिक्वायर्ड व्हेन एनरोलिंग फॉर आधार ऑप्शन ए कास्ट ऑप्शन बी नेम ऑप्शन सी एड्रेस ऑप्शन डी एच एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए कास्ट कीप सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल लाइक एंड शेयर विथ योर फ्रेंड्स एंड फैमिली ओके नेक्स्ट मूव ऑन टू क्वेश्चन नंबर 22 which of the following items of information is captured in HOA based enrollment B1 name of the name of head of the family B2 proof of relationship of resident and HOA B3 head of family aadhar number B4 biometric confirmation of the head of the family at time of enrollment option sir option A One, two, three. Option B. Two, three, four. Option C. One and four. Option D. All the given options. And answer is option D. All the given options. Then next, what are the mandatory documents for head of the family based enrollment? Option A. Proof of relation of resident and head of the family. हेड ऑफ़ द फैमिली आधार नंबर क्वालिफिकेशन प्रूफ ऑफ रेसिडेंस बोथ वन एंड टू एंड आंसर इज बोथ वन एंड टू द मैंडेटरी डॉक्यूमेंट फॉर हेड ऑफ द फैमिली बेस्ड एनरोलमेंट इज प्रूफ ऑफ रेसिडेंस मींस पीओआर और एच एंड एच आधार नंबर नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर 24 फोर व्हाट आर द मैंडेटरी डॉक्यूमेंट फॉर चाइल्ड एनरोलमेंट ऑप्शन आर डेट ऑफ बर्थ प्रूफ आधार नंबर ऑफ एनी वन पेरेंट प्रूफ ऑफ रिलेशन ऑफ चाइल्ड एंड पेरेंट ऑल द गिवेन ऑप्शन एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी ऑल द गिवेन ऑप्शन क्वेश्चन नंबर 25 फाइव व्हाट एड्रेस विल बी मैंशन इन द एनरोलमेंट फॉर्म इन केस ऑफ चाइल्ड एनरोलमेंट ऑप्शन ए एड्रेस ऑफ एनरोलमेंट सेंटर एड्रेस ऑफ द लिंक्ड पेरेंट एड्रेस ऑफ हॉस्पिटल वेयर द चाइल्ड इज बॉर्न ऑप्शन डी ऑल द ऑप्शन गिवेन एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी एड्रेस ऑफ द लिंक्ड पेरेंट क्वेश्चन नंबर 26 ऑपरेटर कैन चार्ज एनी अमाउंट एज ही वांट्स फॉर द आधार एनरोलमेंट ऑप्शन ए ट्रू ऑप्शन बी फॉल्स एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी फॉल्स क्वेश्चन नंबर 27 कॉस्ट ऑफ फ्रेश एनरोलमेंट एंड मैंडेटरी बायोमेट्रिक अपडेट आर चार्ज फ्रॉम द रेसिडेंट ट्रू और फॉल्स एंड आंसर इज फॉल्स मॉडिफिकेशन कैन बी चार्ज फिफ्टी रुपीज पर हेड व्हाट एक्शन विल बी टेकन अगेंस्ट द ऑपरेटर और सुपरवाइजर फॉर चार्जिंग मोर अमाउंट ऑफ मनी As prescribed by the authority, and answer is blacklisting, B FIR, C warning, D either one and two, and answer is either one and two, blacklisted or FIR. Question number twenty-nine. Which of the following refers to biometric details of a resident? 
answers are options are option A financial image option B all 10 fingers option C scan of both iris option D all of the above and answer is all of the given then question number 30 which of the following refers to demographic details of a resident answer is option A email ID and mobile number option B finger impression option C iris scan option D all the gi given options and answer is option A email ID and mobile number question number 31 demographic information required for other enrollment include the following options are option A race and caste option B name address gender date of birth email and mobile number option C income of residence option D medical history of resident and answer is name address gender date of birth email and mobile number then question number 32 the enrollment operator cell desk collect hard copy of supporting documents submit by the residents along with the enrollment form option B capture the biometric information demographic information using the enrollment software provided or approved by the authority approved by the authority scan and store the hard copy with biometric and demographic details submitted by the resident in local hard disk collect and record the demographic information in physical register and answer is option b capture the biometric information demographic information using the enrollment software provided or approved by the authority question number 33 which of the following require mandatory update option a correcting the name of the resident option b updating the email id option c biometric information of child who has attained IPR of age option D updating phone number and answer is option C biometric information of child who has attained IPR of age then question number 34 what is deduplication process in other generation process options are option A checking and rejecting any duplicate enrollments option B copying the enrollment information as backup option c checking if any other person has the same address and rejecting the same and d all the given option and answer is option a checking and rejecting any duplicate enrollment next identify the correct order of other generation process option bit 1 reject any duplicate enrollments option b upload the enrollment packet to cidr option 3 authority generate the number option 4 other number is communicated to the resident option 5 authority process the enrollment data survey and options are option a 23514 means 1 2 3 4 5 b 3 1 4 5 2 c 2 5 1 3 and 4 and answer d 2 1 5 3 5 and answer is Upload the annual packet, annual packet to CIDR Authority process the enrollment data received Reject any duplicate enrollment Authority generate the number Other number is communicated to the resident This is the order Next question number 36 In the event a resident does not possess any of the required supporting document of proof enrollment may be carried out through the dash mode options are option a introduce based enrollment head of family based enrollment option b operator based enrollment other enrollments option c software provided enrollment electronic format based for enrollment 
ऑप्शन डी ई आई डी बेस्ट एनरोलमेंट ऑथोरिटी बेस्ट एनरोलमेंट एंड एंसर इज ऑप्शन ए इंट्रोड्यूसर बेस्ट इंट्रोड्यूसर बेस्ट एनरोलमेंट हेड ऑफ फैमिली बेस्ट एनरोलमेंट क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी सेवन मैंडेटरी बायोमेट्रिक अपडेट फॉर चाइल्ड इज डेस ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए फ्री ऑफ कॉस्ट रुपीज टेन रुपीज फिफ्टीन रुपीज ट्वेंटी एंड एंसर इज फ्री ऑफ कॉस्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी एट इन हुई ऑफ द फॉलोइंग मोड शुड बी यूज रेसिडेंट टू अपडेट हिज और हार बायोमेट्रिक डिटेल्स ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए ऑनलाइन मोड ऑप्शन बी विजिटिंग एनरोलमेंट सेंटर ऑप्शन सी ऑल द गिवेन ऑप्शन एंड आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी विजिटिंग एनरोलमेंट सेंटर क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी नाइन हाउ कैन ए रेसिडेंट ट्रैक द स्टाटस ऑफ अपडेट मेड टू हिज और हर आधार डिटेल्स ऑन ऑथोरिटीज वेबसाइट ऑप्शन सर यूजिंग आधार नंबर ओनली यूजिंग ई आई डी प्रिंटेड ऑन एक्नोलेजमेंट स्लिप और यू आर एन जेनरेटेड थ्रो एस एस यू पी पोर्टल ऑप्शन सी यूजिंग मोबाइल नंबर ओनली डिटेल्स विल बी सेंड टू द रेसिडेंट्स ई मेल आई डी एंड एंसर इज यूजिंग ई आई डी प्रिंटेड ऑन एक्नोलेजमेंट स्लिप और यू आर एन जेनरेटेड थ्रो एस एस यू पी पोर्टल नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी द आधार नंबर मे बी कम्युनिकेटेड टू रेसिडेंट्स इन फिजिकल फॉर्म हुई इनक्लूड डेस्क ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए ईमेल ऑप्शन बी वेबसाइट ऑप्शन सी एस एम एस ऑप्शन डी लेटर एंड एंसर इज ऑप्शन डी बाई लेटर फोर्टी वन आधार अपडेट रिक्वेस्ट एट एनरोलमेंट सेंटर इज कन्फर्म ओनली आफ्टर डेस ऑफ द रेसिडेंट ऑप्शन ए आधार बेस्ट बायोमेट्रिक कन्फर्मेशन ऑप्शन बी सिग्नेचर ऑप्शन सी फोटोग्राफ ऑफ द रेसिडेंट ऑप्शन डी भारबाल कन्फर्मेशन एंड एंसर इज आधार बेस्ड बायोमेट्रिक कन्फर्मेशन क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी टू ईमेल आई डी एंड मोबाइल नंबर कैन बी अपडेट इन आधार बेस्ड आधार डाटा बेस बाय फॉलोइंग मोड ऑप्शन सर विजिटिंग एनरोलमेंट सेंटर एस एस यूपी पोर्टल सी बोथ द गिवेन ऑप्शन एंड एंसर इज विजिटिंग एनरोलमेंट सेंटर क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी थ्री एड्रेस ऑफ द रेसिडेंट कैन बी अपडेटेड इन आधार डाटा बेस बाय फॉलोइंग मोड एंसर इज विजिटिंग एनरोलमेंट सेंटर ऑप्शन बी एस एस यूपी पोर्टल ऑप्शन सी ऑल द गिवेन ऑप्शन एंड एंसर इज ऑप्शन सी ऑल द गिवेन ऑप्शन क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी फोर रेजिस्टर्ड मोबाइल नंबर ऑफ द रेसिडेंट इज मैंडेटरी टू अपडेट एड्रेस थ्रो ऑनलाइन मोड एस एस यूपी पोर्टल ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ट्रू ऑप्शन बी फॉल्स एंड एंसर इज ऑप्शन ए ट्रू क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी फाइव रेजिस्टर्ड मोबाइल नंबर ऑफ द रेसिडेंट इज मैंडेटरी टू अपडेट न्यू मोबाइल नंबर थ्रो ऑनलाइन मोड एस एस यूपी पोर्टल ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए मोबाइल नंबर कैन नॉट बी अपडेट यूजिंग एस एस यूपी पोर्टल ऑप्शन बी नॉट रिक्वायर्डेड ऑप्शन सी रिक्वायर्डेड ऑप्शन डी ऑल द गिवेन ऑप्शन एंड एंसर इज मोबाइल नंबर कैन नॉट बी अपडेट यूजिंग एस एस यूपी पोर्टल क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी सिक्स ओ टी पी इज सेंड ऑन हुई मोबाइल नंबर फाइल सबमिटिंग द एड्रेस अपडेट थ्रो एस एस यूपी पोर्टल ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए मोबाइल नंबर रेजिस्टर्ड इन आधार मोबाइल नंबर ऑफ ऑपरेटर और सुपरवाइजर मोबाइल नंबर ऑफ स्पाउस और गार्डियन ऑल द गिवेन ऑप्शन एंड एंसर इज मोबाइल नंबर रेजिस्टर्ड इन आधार नेक्स्ट ऑपरेटर और सुपरवाइजर में अपडेट हीज और हार ओन मोबाइल नंबर फॉर ऑल द अपडेट डन बाय हिम और हार एंसर ट्रू और फॉल्स एंड एंसर इज ऑप्शन बी फॉल्स क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी एट ऑपरेटर और सुपरवाइजर में एड एडिशनल इंफॉर्मेशन इन द सिस्टम विदाउट रेसिडेंट कॉन्सेंट ट्रू और फॉल्स एंसर इज फॉल्स देन क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी नाइन रेसिडेंट कैन गेट द अपडेट आधार थ्रो फॉलोइंग मोड्स यूजिंग रेजिस्टर्ड मोबाइल नंबर ऑप्शन सर ऑप्शन ए डाउनलोडेड ई आधार डाउनलोडेड एम आधार विजिट नियरेस्ट साइबर कैफे बथ वन एंड टू 
and answer is option D both 1 and 2 question number 50 resident can get the updating of demographic information using postal service option true or false and answer is option B false thank you guys that's all for today keep subscribe our channel like and share with your friends if you are watching at Facebook then like our page follow us on Instagram our Instagram ID is the creation thank you guys best of luck for your next exam